So, this is Tim. <laughs> Say hi, Tim. Hi, Tim. Hi, Andy. And this is the beast he's come to test ride. So we've got the 1200 GT Pro. As you can see there. It's a dash. So we're hoping to go out on a, on a ride with this now. And this one after. And then followed by the 900 GT Pro, which is the one I want. Not necessarily in red, but, uh, but that's nice. Well, they're both nice. They're all nice, aren't they? All the bikes are nice. Anyway, no further ado. My GoPro is playing up a bit, so I don't know if I'll be able to film it or not. We shall see. It's in here. The battery isn't seated right for some reason. God bloody thing. Anyway, see you in a bit. Right, this is Tim on the bike now. Looking good, I think. So, uh, this is Bevan's in Cardiff. Yeah. Yeah, it looks quite good, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, trick suspension thing here on the back, is it? Very nice. Right, catch you in a minute. First of all, I'm having a little bit of a problem here with the GoPro again. I'm sure that the microphone would be okay. Um, but the... It wasn't working on the way down. And it seems to be because the battery was not seating correctly. Ah, oh, God, it's... You know, what is it with these cameras? Just switch it on, work, please. So anyway, we're, we're here now as uh, Tim's going out on a bit of a test ride with this 1200. Look, shaft drive as well. And uh, yeah, it's looking quite nice, isn't it? It's sounding good. Can you hear me, Tim? No. God, don't we just love looking at new bikes? I just know that my... I, I'd need to have um, Elton John type platforms if I was to ride that. Oh, I follow um, Midlife Motorcycle Diaries on YouTube and it's a couple. And uh, the guy's got um, a GS. And his wife has got uh, the 900 GT Pro, and she absolutely loves it. So it's um, I, I I I don't know. It's it's not. <laughs> I'm not trying to say it's a girl's bike or anything. It's not. You know. It's. Uh, I don't know. I can see you ending up with that one. <sighs> Kids on the road. They didn't. <laughs> not sure which way they're going. No. So, this is um, talking to my thousands of um, subscribers a minute. This is the um, famous Barry Island, or Barry Bados as they call it. Up there, that pink building on the right in front of us is a snooker club where I used to frequent a lot in the 80s. And... Um, this is Gavin and Stacy country. Probably Barry's biggest claim to fame at the moment. How far back can I go, Tim? Yeah. Sure. 
Okie doke. All good. Well, that was nice having an ice cream and, uh, and a cup of coffee. Yeah, 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 it gives you time to think. Do you see what I mean about your indicators? Look how high, how high they are at the back. Great with the top box on it, but vulnerable without. I guess on here. Yeah, I think this is it. Oh, yeah, this is Trinity Street. This is meant to be the steepest uh, street in Barry, and it's also Gavin and Stacey Street. If you get yourself ready, because we're going to stop on the hill up here a little bit. <laughs> Nothing behind you, so um, it's on the left-hand side, and it's there. It is. It's got all the. That's it. That's that's the Gavin and Stacey one, right? And turn left here. Sorry, I'm not indicating. And that. Oh, hang on. That is where I used to live on the end there. And we bought that for 43,000, I think it was, back in about 1985, 86. That's where my son grew up. This would take us to the top road, if we bear left here. You go first if you want him. Yeah. Right. In, in what way, engine or? Ah, oh, okay. I, I have ridden a, an 800 and I actually thought that was mega comfortable. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, not on it, yeah. And that's what you're feeling, you're a bit on it, are you? Rather than in it, yeah. Yeah, I... When we get back, I'm gonna ask him to put it in the low position and then I'll, I'll sit on it. It's, uh, put your legs down now. Put your legs down. Oh yeah, yeah, you ample. Again, that, that one sounds nice, you know? It's got a deep, um, like a deep throat. It's not so whiny as, as mine is. Sounds a lot deeper. Oh, I heard that as well. Through, through your microphone here. <laughs> oh, well. Right, I catch up with you thousands of subscribers a little bit later. Okay, so, so far we have tested the 900 GT, the 1200 GT Pro, the 900 is a Pro as well. I have to say, this is a very handsome bike. Very nice looking. For me, the 900 has been put in the shade a little bit by that. I don't know which would suit me better though, because I'm a bit of a short ass. And then you've got Tim on the Rally Pro, which has um, got plenty of road presence as well. Where's the fog lights on that then? There's none. No fog lights. So if we have a look around. Right there, just... Yeah, 
Yeah, very nice. That looks very, very nice indeed. And you got the old faithful here, which I feel very comfortable on. Nothing like a new bike though. I'm just going to say goodbye now from Automobile by Sea.